Hey guys, it's Lori. I'm sporting my garage sale shirt today. It fits. It's fine. There's nothing wrong with it. <laughs> about to leave and head out to a job and so I'm just looking at my my gourd plant it is like so huge it's gotten really really big oh my gosh I have this thing hanging on my front porch that's a letter C for our last name and I got it in the wine fairy baskets that were going on like during the beginning of the the shelter in place orders and it turns around sometimes the wind blows just right and flips it around so i need to fix that i can't leave and just leave it like that i'll show Look it to that you crazy gourd i gotta show you guys the big one i gotta show you let me find it look how big this thing is it's getting huge <laughs> okay let's come up here My Bluetooth is trying to pair. So here's this thing that flips around backwards all the time. <laughs> That's better. All right, let's get you back up here on the mirror. <laughs> and I gotta head to my job because right now there's no train. So I need to get across the tracks before a train comes. <laughs> my job is done and I'm a little earlier than I expected. So. I'm going to go ahead and run to the bank and do my banking for the week. And while I am nearby a Walmart, I'm going to go to Walmart as well because I want some staples for my staple gun. I have a new staple gun that I've had for quite a while. I've never used it. Well, I have some staples and they don't fit. So I need to get some different staples and I also want them to be shorter because the ones I have are way too long. Anyway, I'm working on a project, which I'll share with you guys in the next couple of days. And, uh, yeah, I need some staples for my staple gun. This road was closed this morning and I had to go way out and around to get here to this job. Let me see what's going on. Is the road still closed? I don't think so. Oh, I don't know. Something's going on up here, but I think the road's open. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I'm gonna run to Walmart. I'm gonna run to the bank. I'm all done at Walmart and I just accidentally blew my horn with this box that I have sitting in front of me. And there's a guy going around collecting carts and he keeps looking over here at me. <laughs> oh well, that's all right. And I still have my mask on my arm because I always put it there so I don't accidentally drop it. This is my favorite mask and it's getting all weird looking because I've washed it lots of times. But it's my favorite one because it actually just covers where it's supposed to cover. It doesn't try to go up to my eyeballs or anything. <laughs> anyway. So the box that I blew my horn with is actually this fan. I have been looking for this fan for a long time and I actually don't generally go into Walmart. So I've been looking for it on the Walmart pickup app and it always says out of stock always. And now it's not even on there. So I thought, what the heck? I'm going to look, I'm going to see what kind of fans they do have Hayden's been wanting a fan for his room. This is the kind of fan that works amazing. I love these, these little fans. They're small, they don't take up a lot of space, but they work really good. I finally actually went inside and found that fan that keeps saying that it's out of stock. Well, the only reason I even bought a fan this time of year, I mean, it's fall, it's starting to get to be where if you open your windows, it's plenty of airflow. But I like to have a fan in my kitchen because when I use my oven, I like to have, I, I just turn a fan on for a little bit because it gets so hot in there. Well, Brendan needed a fan because he's got a couple of online classes and he needs to be upstairs where it's kind of a little bit stuffy. So he went to the house today. He texted me earlier, asked me about it. I'm like, go ahead. It's fine. It's, you know, it's fall. I'll be all right without a fan. I said, go ahead and take mine. So he has a fan, but it makes all kinds of weird noises and I don't really like him using it. It's like, what's wrong with that fan? Is it gonna catch on fire? Or, you know, this this guy just pulled back here and I, I don't know, he's, he's freaking me out. I'm gonna put my window up. Just because. <laughs> you never know. Okay. 
Just a second. Give me a minute. I want to see what this guy's doing before I continue. The thing is, I'm in the back 40 of the parking lot. This is mostly like the employee's parking lot. Sometimes there's semi-trucks back here and there's really like no one else back here. So I'm going to wait and see what this guy's doing. Apparently he's just going to sit there. I'm going to adjust my mirror so I can look at him. <laughs> all right, let me just continue. If anything happens, call the cops, all right? I got some of these uh, eucalyptus things and also some of these. No, this is the eucalyptus. This is the lamb's ear. I saw Vicki Marie Living Life do a haul recently from Walmart, and I'm pretty sure these are the exact ones that she got. I know she got the lamb's ear. This is, these are $2 a piece. So it's, you know, it's good quality, and there's two of them on here. They're like twist tied together, but there's two of them. And this one has a pretty good amount of the eucalyptus on it. So yes, you can get greenery at Dollar Tree cheaper, but really not because you get two of them for $2. And with this, this is a nice full bunch. So anyway, I'm not going to really give prices this time because I just, I don't feel like it. I got my receipt right here, but let's just not even do prices this time. If anybody wants to know the price of something, just ask me and I'll try, try to look at my receipt and tell you. Anyway, I picked up some jeans. These are like, um, what are they calling them? They're Levi's in their boyfriend jeans. So this is the back pocket. It's just, it's got a little design on it, but you can't see it very well. Can you see that design? So yeah, that's the back pocket and it's got like the, um, sort of distressed a little bit and it's got the rip in the knee. I don't care too much about that. I do like it that way and it's got a rolled up cuff. So I did not get to try these on because the dressing rooms are closed because of the, you know, COVID. So anyway, I guess I'll take them home and try them on and hope they fit. There you go. I'll toss them back here. Okay, I also grabbed another pair of jeans. These are No Boundaries brand, and they're just mid-rise boot-cut jeans. Just basic jeans, very basic, plain pockets, and I need some new jeans. I really need some new jeans, so I grabbed some. I don't generally buy jeans at Walmart because I usually don't care for them all that much, but it's been a really, really long time since I've purchased any jeans here. So I figured I'd give them a try. If I don't like them, I'm going to bring them back. I also grabbed this shirt and it is Time and True. Can you even see that? Time and True. I love that brand. I have the, um, yeah, the red and black, like Buffalo check shirt. So I got the black and white one. I eyeballed this last year and never got it. So I'm getting it this time. <laughs> I also grabbed another pair of black leggings, just your standard $4.44, I think it is. Yeah, $4.44. Basic black leggings, no boundaries brand. I already have a couple pairs, but I love them. I wear them all the time. One pair I don't care for because they're a little too short. I hope these aren't too short. I don't know. Sometimes they're not exactly... <laughs> the same length but these kind of a olive green color yeah I don't have any of that color at all so I just thought I'd grab those and I also grabbed a little package of the mini sized glue sticks I need some more of the mini sized glue sticks for my Sherbonder glue gun so I figured I'd try the Sherbonder brand I really wanted to get the Gorilla brand but I just got a small package. This was like 98 cents for this package of 10 because I want to try them and see what kind of quality they are. The ones that I have now, I think, are the Dollar Tree ones and they're okay, but they're not the greatest quality. Like, they're not very strong glue. So, I saw this little can cooler and I just couldn't resist it. I, yes, yes, I was looking at the Halloween stuff. Why? I don't know. Because I did a Dollar Tree haul and I said, I am not doing any more Halloween or fall. This is it. Well, I guess I meant at the Dollar Tree. <laughs> Marnie, you were right. You were right. You didn't believe me and you were right. You were right. 
<laughs> okay. I couldn't resist it though. <laughs> I just thought it was so cute. Witches be tripping. <laughs> it's just a little Cancuzzi thing for 98 cents. What the heck? <laughs> and this is actually what I wanted at Walmart. This is the reason I stopped. I got my staples. Okay, I also saw these bath caddies. It's just a Mainstays brand bath caddy. I am going to look at the price on this because I think it was really cheap. Yeah, this was only $3.97. It's pretty good sized for a bath caddy. I am going to use this for a cleaning basket. I would, I really need a new cleaning basket. The one that I have is so old that I can't get it clean anymore. <laughs> that sounds weird. It's for cleaning supplies, but I can't get it clean. It's just got streaks and spots on it. And I just, I just wanted a new cleaning basket. So I'm going to try using that and see how that works. If it doesn't work out for work, I'll use it at home. Okay. Now <laughs> I got a couple other things that are Halloween. I want to do spooky decorations outside this year. I really, really hope we have trick or treat, but we probably won't. Then I'm going to be really super bummed because I really am looking forward to doing this stuff for trick or treat night. I don't know. I haven't heard anything about it yet. I've been checking like our local website, but anyway, I got some window clings. This one, the skeleton or the skull, I should say. I think that looks cool. Also, this one, I'm not sure. It's just a creepy, ooh, a creepy person. <laughs> That's going to look so cool in my front window. I hope we have trick or treat. <laughs> and this one, this one's just, yeah, kind of disturbing. But. <laughs> okay, okay. Anyway, I got those. And the very last thing that I got is one of these projectors. I've been wanting one of these for so long and I would love to have this uh, color changing. I thought it was all the same color. Darn it. <laughs> oh, well, that's okay. It has this little try me button on the front. So we'll see if it'll, I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Yeah, you can see it. See the shapes back there? spooky stuff ghosts and trees and bats and yep it's color changing all right it's changing colors that's okay I still like it I've been wanting one forever okay I've been wanting one ever since they came out with them I don't think that's really forever but okay <laughs> that's everything guys that is everything thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow